Holy Terry Goose Women. Hi, right, we're gonna do a quick review because um it's getting late, so let's let's just dive straight into it. Yeah, dive through swimming. Yeah, anyways, um Right well, it starts off with Holy Terry having a bad dream, like she does say she he in the swim falls and is getting chased by sharks. Like yeah, even if even though he's like on the ground, the shark somehow uses a skateboard. Logic what is that? Hangry Hangry I rape you with my shark saying hangry. Yes My god, that sounds like a pedophile shark to me. No seriously it does. Okay, we wake up and it's a no joke. Um Early bird, can I just say we're hungry? I was expecting Henry to say like No women want to hear worm And get that quickly, um Now we can learn that she needs to go swimming today But I'm gonna say this, uh, my opinion on the swimming lessons Um Swimming is um Sometimes I would look forward to it, sometimes I wouldn't I mean, I used to have, like, a swimming lesson a week outside of school. You know, like, um, I go home after school for, like, a few minutes and then go to a swimming lesson or something. Yeah. Um, yeah, that's that. Um, um, it's, um, pretty nice. It's pretty, like, when you get out of a swim pool, you feel fresh, like in the shower. Oh my god, don't remind me of a sh- um, the swim pool showers. I uh, not like I have any bad experiences with it. Blech. I think um one of the good parts of um the swimming lessons are girls. Duh, that sounds weird, I know. But it's natural for boys to say that, so don't pester me or something. I'm just saying. But anyway, back to the topic. Um, I do with Henry's kitchen, and um, I think Henry has a point here. What if swimming go to education? Like, answer me that. What does swimming have to do with education? Like, like, what are you supposed to learn from it? Like, learn how to swim. Actually, yeah, that's actually pretty good, like, I learned how to swim, like, not, don't, like, how to swim properly, and don't tr try to, like, suffer from drowning. Uh, I think that's how you, swimming is, in, is educational. Um, and, um, after Henry says that, Sam says, swimming is a lesson. Completely ignoring Henry's question. Um, Peter made a whole point of a funny joke. Why you don't get get school of dolphins? How is that funny? I don't get it. Schools of dolphins. Um, shut up, Peter. Henry makes some good points of why people hate swimming because chlorine stings your eyes, which I really hate. I, yeah, I would use goggles. Well, for some reason, I used to be scared of wearing goggles. I just didn't want to wear them. Like, I would not put my face in the water. Like, no, no, thank you. Put my head in the water. I'm washing my hair out, but not put my face in the water. Nope. Um, it's not always cool, you can, like, like, one way the saying goes, um, if you feel cold, warm, um, move around to make it warmer. Never forget, it should happen to me. Um, um, then I really pretend he's got a Ravuka, 
Um, actually, kind of reminds me. Um, come back my Xbox in a minute. Um, like what if, like, if I have the, I don't have a Vuka. I'm actually, I don't know. I'm actually now um, my Vuka is like on top of a foot, and this is actually on my um, um, we call it um the bottom of my foot, I should say. I mean, what is that anyway? I'm actually gonna find out in the morning. So, back foot back on topic. Back on topic, um. My mug. My looking mug. Um, then Peter said, gets gross out of her saying it ate his own Vuka. Peter, are you seriously dumb? Like, um, like, would you believe a Veruca will fall off, or, like, just, or be able to eat it? Do you believe, oh my god. Alright, cut to the, I will cut to, um, the bus. To, um, the school bus. Um, it's my little nitpick, um, the, uh, the children chatting on, um, the bus, but, that's not actually the right audio clip for children shouting on a bus. It sounds more like, um, people, like other citizens of the town, like, like, uh, men, women, little children, um, teenagers chattering. That's what it sounds like. Not actual students chattering. That sounds more people chattering. I think here's the one audio clip then. Henry, no, Henry, Henry, Ralph uh, tries to scare Henry, and made, they made a deal that if he gets scared, he'll get, get his 50p pocket money to him, and they came up with this brilliant plan to get out of the summer weapon, and what they do, they distract um, the students by why tell him to look out the window because there's a mountain lion there? Well, it's got the back turn. They climb into um the, the school bag. They take out the swim costume. Um, I think Henry would just look at the girls' costume. Uh, uh, never mind, sorry. Um, I forgot Henry doesn't like girls. Gay and sexist. Um, and they chuck him out of the window. Here's my little problem. When, um, the children, like, going on one side of a bus, it does a driver, it's just, it does, um, does a, does the children on the side of a bus really, um, um, not tilt the bus over? Like, you can see that driver just straining. Like, like, why? I don't think that will happen in real life. I mean, there's a lot of children, but I don't think that, Children are heavier than the bus. Okay, um, they, um, Henry's glad. Uh, here's what I see, want to see in real life. Like, um, if every people did not have a phone case, what would happen? Like, I mean, they would cancel, of course, but would, would something worse happen? Like, hey, like, um, I don't know, um, a quadruple detention or something? I don't know. And then, Ralph comes along in his very costume. Anyway, minute, it's, it's the Dark Avengers chair from six, three, like they came and sold them really well. Um, they told him that we can have an extra swimming lesson tomorrow. And we're doing badges. Then Henry has another dream. First time, um, the shock makes Henry jump in the air and fall in back in the floor. Well, the shock skips it right in. 5.3! 5.5! No spoilers, man. No spoilers. Okay, the next morning, I go actually go to the swimming pool center. Henry makes up a rumor that there are sharks in the pool. Like, 
why would somebody believe her shocking thing? I mean, if you just look it down in there, and look right down, you can clearly do oh, yeah. I'm sorry, you must see a shark shaped finny in a pool. I mean, in the shower and peacefully, but the deep end? Um, yeah, you can still see it. You could, you could still not see a shark there. Okay, so they're actually gonna get ready uh, for a swim lesson. And we get introduced to a new character, well, kind of a proper introduce, Doggy Sit. Um, I say a uh, proper because we've seen him in um, Hot Angry at the end of Hot Angry and the Demon Lady. Demon Lady. So, yeah, it's the swim teacher and the gym coach. This is actually the spoiler alert. This is actually this is actually the only episode in the entire series where he's done swimming lessons. So okay then, I guess it's more of a gym coach then. Um, they get Shangri to finally put on a cost that costume. Most of them are ridiculous. I mean, wh why would they even wear like a girl's costume? I wear some a paddle in a suit, but it won't fit. And I think in the book, I think in the original story in the book, there's it's got a di diaper in there. Right, who puts that in there? Whatever. And, um, there's a Henry right here. <laughs> oh my god, look at Henry. He's buff. As soon as Mark is out, he's a scary character. He's scared of the water. And Henry's all telling, I'm not scared. I'll show you. Oh my god. That's hilarious. Oh my god, um. Um. Um, Margaret, I think this just enough making a badger of a uh, Tom and Chicken. How would be dark my teacher to do that? Like, seriously. Um, let me, like, try to do five meters. I think you actually probably count them. Um, I don't think I said, um, it's like that. Hang on. I said swim, not walk. Can we look like even walk in? I mean, some people say it's walking, but to me, it looks like, um, actual cement, but not, but, uh, his feet touch the ground. Like he's paddling, but not straight paddling, you see? Um, oh god, we're running out of time. Um, <laughs> okay, we're gonna wrap this up. Um, can we spread, can we, Andrew, and Suzanne just spreads among the rest of the shark in the pool. Everyone is scared to swim in the pool. But Sophie says, like, no, no swimmers, just get in the pool. And she says something. And look, I'm, I'm eaten by sharks. If you don't go back to the school and swim, pool and swim, I'll box you myself. I mean it, swim. That's one way to get out. Just turn around, just turn around, swim! No! Hmm. Any? Swim, swim, no! Oh my god. Um, okay, the episode ends with, I think the moral of the story is, yeah, swimming is an education is, it's educational because you can get to be an Olympic. But overall though, we're 40 minutes in, this is a, um, it's actually one of the best episodes of Hulk Henry Season 1. Um, if you guys want to watch the original episode, I'll leave um, the original episode link in the description. And, yeah. I wonder what the next one going to be swimming. Like, seriously. Um, this is the other sign out. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. This is Alan